Hey YouTube, this is Dave from My Tech Man Cave. Today I'd like to show you a quick video on an app that I just downloaded. Uh, it's called Media Connect and you can find it in the iTunes Store for the iPad. And what I like about this is um, I have a Mac at home and I have uh, TV Mobili uh, um, installed on it. And what that is is a server software that you can install on your Mac and it allows you to serve up uh, your media from your folders right to the iPad or any other DLNA uh, devices. Uh, so let's get started. I'll show you what you need. Uh, first things first, download the app. It's free in the iTunes store to try. Uh, you can stream the first three uh, files in each folder that you designate um, to be streamed. And if you're happy with the software, you can buy an in-app purchase of $7.99 um, currently uh, and be able to stream all the media that uh, you have designated to stream. Uh, the next piece of software you're going to need is mo uh, tvmobili.com. Um, and what it is is a server that you put on your Mac and you can designate folders like I did here. I wrote, uh, here's my content. Uh, by default, it has uh, video, music, images, and folders, and you, you can add more content. And when you add content, you basically get your uh, Mac hard drive, uh, you know, listed in a Explorer Finder kind of thing. And uh, what I did was I cho chose volumes and um, I picked my external hard drive and I chose my MP4 folder. That's where I put all my ripped DVDs, uh, ripped, uh, you know, uh, TV shows that I recorded on Media Center. And uh, basically, I chose that folder and the music folder beneath it. And when I look in my folders, uh, you see these two folders there. And the reason you get. Uh, you get this explanation point is because I have a lot of media and it's still uploading so once you get everything uploaded uh, this will go away and you'll be have access now as far as the app goes um, on the iPad if you open up that app you'll be able to let me take you to the home screen you'll be able to as soon as the app is installed, it will pick up um, over Wi-Fi and know exactly what you have uh, that streams over D and DLNA, and um, it will find it there. So, so basically, it's this here. That's the uh, TV Mobility app, and um, if you connect to that you'll see that it's the same as these folders, my content and my friend's content. Basically, you can share with that mobile app. So my content, my content, my friend's content, my friend's content. So I click my content, I tap my t content, and you can see that it all matches up evenly. Uh, once you have the Mac, the uh, iPad, um, you know, upstairs in a different room or something, this that you don't really need to be playing with this uh, server software so you just close it out uh, basically and it runs in the background uh, and you could just go ahead and play with your with your folders and find something that you like I go into my move, movie folder and since I can only do the first three I'll just show you quickly uh, a recording I did uh, using Media Center and Windows 7 but then I bought a Mac, so so here it is. Uh, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna play too much of it. I just want to show you that it comes in, uh, streams quickly, and it's pretty nice. So you know, there's all my MP4 movies that I got full access to on my iPad. Uh, it's just like any other uh, Google TV. I could do it with. I could do it with an Xbox. Definitely with. Uh, PlayStation uh, and uh, every everybody's got it so why not the iPad so anyway that's my video and uh, I'll leave some 
links in the description please follow me and uh, like this video and hope to see you soon thank you very much